I'm usually a Maxis Match or even a Maxis Mix kind of girl, but I really, really wanted to make a realistic sim. So that's what we're gonna I do went today. I shopping over the weekend and I downloaded a couple of new Alpha CC and I'm so excited, but also so nervous because I haven't made an Alpha sim in at least a year. So I'm gonna try to make the most realistic sim as I can today and you're all gonna come along with me. So starting out, we're just gonna work on the face. I need to get a sim that fits my vibe and then we'll adjust from there. I'm honestly really nervous about this because I'm just so used to making Maxis mix sims and trying to make a super realistic sim is kind of scary because like how realistic can you make a sim really? We're gonna find out today but I'm honestly really excited about this. How many times am I going to say I'm excited about this? Too many times. Okay, so I think I have a face where I like it, where we can start putting on the Alpha CC. So first off, we definitely have to change the eyebrows. And luckily, I already had like a bunch of Alpha eyebrows. And to be honest, I actually prefer Alpha eyebrows. There's just something about them that I just like over Max's match. But okay. So I have a vibe for the sim I want. These eyebrows, I like them. I think we might go for them. I like how realistic these look, so we'll stick with that. And now let's go into skin details. So I've downloaded a couple of Obscurious's skin details because they look realistic and pretty alpha. Yeah, this is definitely a bit out of my comfort zone, but you know what? We're gonna try to make it work. Don't mind me if I like adjust 5 million things. So I think we'll go with that skin. I might adjust lips because I love these lips usually but for the skin overlay I'm just not vibing with it as much as I thought I would so I think I'm gonna just look around for a bit to find a different lip preset watch me go back to the one I originally had knowing okay. I surprisingly did not go back to the original lip preset that I had but this is what we have so far I do want to add a little bit more skin details I'm thinking freckles or maybe some video marks here and there I think that could be fine yes look at that I love the small little details like that so that's really cute that's a vibe and now to really add on to the realistic look of the sim we definitely have to change the eyes because the eyes are too max to match to be realistic. So we're definitely going to go with my contacts that I have. Oh yeah, that's starting to look like a super realistic sim. Look at that. I want this sim to look like it's from a whole different game. And I feel like I'm capturing that vibe. I really want to go for brown eyes for this sim. And then on top of that, we definitely have to give this sim lash because lashes definitely changes a sim completely. Oh, yes, I really like the smaller lashes on this sim. I honestly feel like these lashes look very, very realistic on this sim. Okay, I'm loving her. I'm loving her. Definitely super different from my normal style. And now we can play with the hairstyle, which is so fun. I haven't touched alpha hair in so long, and this is so fun i like this color but i really don't like how it meshes with the ear so that's quite a bummer <gasps> wow look at that one talk about realistic blowing in the wind like that this hair is stunning the only issue for me is trying to find the right hair swatch for it i really live for the brown but i wish there was like another swatch of brown i don't know what to do okay we'll just go for this one for now i really like that that one's really pretty wow Wowie. Okay, how many times am I going to say wow in this video? Too many times, I think. And now we go for the outfit for this sim. That could be really pretty. Oh, this dress is gorgeous, though. That could be a look, but I definitely want to go through other options. Maybe since it's cold over here, I kind of want to give her a sweater because it makes sense because her hair is flowing through the wind. So I would assume it's like a bit chilly where she is. 
Oh, this one is so cute too. This top is everything. I might actually keep this top for myself to use for my other sims because I usually don't download alpha clothes for my feminine sims. I might stick with the sweater for now. Now we gotta find some alpha jeans or pants that can go well with this or we might just do a whole other different vibe because I'm not really vibing with that. This top is so pretty too. Look at this top or this one this one's so cute too help i don't know what to choose maybe we can go for this top and then i wonder if i have any like things that we can put underneath to make it more winter attire friendly this could be so cute if it was just like plain okay you know i changed the color of the top and i feel like this matches the shirt underneath so much better and that is a look and i I'm actually living for it. So I think we'll go with that. Now we just have to find some bottoms that can go well with that. Oh, I'm actually living for the denim skirt. I'm actually living for this. I don't know, for some reason, I kind of vibe with these stockings. I'm definitely trying to push myself out of the comfort zone, but I think I'm gonna go with that for now. And then these shoes could be so cool. I'm thinking like chunky boots, that could be fun. Okay, I kind of like that. I like that more grungier look for this sim. And like with those nails too. So we have that. Now I'm still thinking if I want this hair. And then I think I might just adjust her face a little bit more. That can be a look. Now let's try to give her some makeup. This might take me a while because makeup takes me so long for some reason. <laughs> So I have the makeup look all together and it really, really made everything look better. I was getting nervous, I won't lie, but now that I put on makeup on her, she's looking so good. Now I'm just gonna like maybe go through the hair once more and like see if I really, really want this. I definitely want to go through some of the other alpha CC hair that I downloaded and see if there's anything else that could possibly okay, work Okay, so I went back to the original hair. I tried giving her other alpha hair that I downloaded, but I really like this one. I really love these two swatches. I really like the brown, but I also like the black hair with that streak of white in there. But y'all, I'm so sorry. I'm a Libra, okay? I can't decide, but let's go ahead and give her some accessories accessories and like just finalize this look okay so here we go here is the completed look here is my realistic sim that i made and i love her so much honestly it took me quite a while to get where i am and i was super super nervous because it was just like something i was not used to but at the end of the day i think she looks pretty realistic this hair is just everything and i love her outfit i'm so glad i was able to like give her an outfit it that looked pretty good and i gave her some tattoos oh, as well that was super fun if you did enjoy this video definitely let me know in the comments below and by giving this video a huge thumbs up but thank you so much for watching everyone and i will see you all in the next video bye everyone